All right, fear the spotlight. Here we freaking finally go. Ah, oh, I'm so late to the party on this one. Um, I wanted to play this like right when it came out. But right when it came out, I got really sick for like a week and then I had a bunch of other projects to do and it was a mess. But fear the spotlight. I've been looking forward to this one for a while. If you've uh, followed my channel for a while, you'll know that I actually played both demos of this. One of them very recently, which I'm pretty sure is just like the beginning of this. So you might see some repeats. But yeah, fear the spotlight. Been super excited for this one for a while. Let's go. Everything about this looks so cool to me, so let's see where this goes. I'm really curious about the story. Do you see anyone? Nah, it's totally empty. Let's go. Let's go! Use WASD to walk. Sure enough. Library is this way, right? Yeah, it's just around the corner. Yeah, this is just the, uh, the beginning that we saw last time. A sign next to the door. Faculty offices. I was just in the counselor's office last week. Oh, right. She said your boots were a distraction? <laughs> yeah, well, at least I got to sit in detention all day instead of going to class. I'm pretty sure I said this last well, time too, but that distraction thing is a cool pair of boots, just bullshit. <laughs> like, library? Here we come. Oops, I think we skipped some dialogue. Uh, actually, the library is the other way. You really don't go to the library much. <laughs> oh, ha ha. No, but apparently you have superpowers and can face your face through a door. The library, but Books are really not my scene. You say that, but you're really missing out. Also, you look like you would read some black magic tomes, so, you know. I'm just gonna check everything again. If you've seen this already in the demo playthrough, sorry, but I'm gonna go through it all again. A poster in the display case. Sunnyside High, our motto. Building trust, inspiring growth, and nurturing relationships with each and every student. It's a poster in the display case. In the spirit of fall, we are now showcasing our collection on occult history. Come learn more about this fun subject at the library. It is a fun subject. I'm not even being facetious. It is. It's locked. Don't worry. I've got this. Little Miss Criminal. Here you go. So, how did you learn to pick locks? <laughs> My older brother. He was obsessed with lock picking videos. I find it so funny that she won't look at the camera. <laughs> I don't know why. What else did he teach you? How to use pepper spray, how to forge my parents' signature, <laughs> not to talk to cops. You know, important stuff. Clearly. Ah. ah, here we go. I think I have a theory on why she won't look at the player, but I can teach you too I'll save that for want. later. My parents would kill me if I ever forged their signature. They'd kill you if they knew where we were right now. That's true. My English teacher did say I needed more life experience for my college applications. But I doubt he meant breaking and entering. Probably not. My corruption skills are worth Biff, get down. Oh. Oh no, is somebody I'm here? a little too fast. I keep no, skipping dialogue. It's just a security camera. Stay down and out of the light. Wait here with me until I say go. Boy, she's not into this. Go, Viv. Yeah, you're not quite as adventurous as your as your friend here, huh? Okay. Get ready. Run for it. There we go. You made it. That was a close one. <laughs> Great job. Ooh, thunderstorm. Just to make it extra creepy. Holy crap. The weather couldn't be more perfect. I hope the board looks as old and creepy as I imagine. We'll it see. Totally does. You're gonna love it. Alright, let's see here. I do love these voice actresses. They're doing a great job. The poster reads, Vote Jessica for senior class president. A friend to all. Friend? What a joke. Just last week, I overheard her talking crap about me in the bathroom. Ugh, what a jerk. We don't need friends like that. We've got each other. Sounds good to me. Yeah, for anyone who's facing that in school, just treasure the friends you do have. They will help you through it. Whoa. Speaking from experience here. <laughs> this must be it. 
Can you take it out? Yeah, one second. Except for the part where it's locked, if I recall. A disheveled old book. There's an information card that reads, Here lies the Book of Lost Memories. It is a collection of notes and photographs that are set to answer the secret history of our neighboring haunted town. Yeah, I'm going to go through all of this again because I don't remember any of it, so... Set of tarot cards. There's an information card that reads, Tarot cards are believed to tap into unknown energy. They may provide guidance for the future, reveal hidden feelings of love, or offer a glimpse into the past. A collection of novels, perfectly, uh, perfect for the fall season. There's a haunted house story, one about a teenager with witch powers, and a romance story with vampire ghosts. These were my favorite picks from last month. I bet Amy would love them. It's an unassuming old radio. There's an information card that reads, Here lies a spectro-sensitive radio. This radio can tap into the distorted sounds of a horrifying alternate world. And I'm pretty sure this is a deliberate Silent Hill shout-out, which I love. It's a copy of the book To Kill a Mockingbird. There is an information card that reads, This paperback copy was found in the attic of an ancient creepy cult. Reader beware, you're in for a fright. Something tells me the librarian ran out of things to put in the display. Yeah, I'd say so. That's, that's a flimsy-ass excuse to put <laughs> To Kill a Mockingbird in there. That's the spirit board I need. If I open the display case, I can grab it. The cabinet needs a key to be unlocked. Ooh, a letter I wrote for Amy. I plan on giving it to her at the end of the night. I'm so nervous for her to read this. I really poured my heart on this letter. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, you got it bad, girl. Alright. Don't have the item that I need, so that sucks. I need to go grab the key for the display case. The librarian keeps it in the office. I'll be right back. Sounds good. I'll go find a spot to set up while you're doing that. Now, if I remember, there's not actually a whole lot to see right now. Except I need a key from back here. Photo display. Student volunteer of the month, Vivian Singh. Oh boy, I forgot about this. Hope Amy doesn't see. I won't hear the end of it. Man, there's nothing to be ashamed of. Here's where they keep our key cards. Yoink. That's a mine. She's already off on her own little adventure. That's good. Okay. These are, you know, these are surprisingly modern looking computers for a school library. I'm so used. Uh, maybe it's because I live in a rural town. But I'm so used to um, school and public library equipment being like decades out of date. <laughs> oh well. Let's see. There it is. That's the key for the display case. Just double checking if there's anything interesting around, but nope. Let's get in there. It's a key card reader. Volunteering at the library has its perks. Okay, let's see here. The plans for the school renovations. They finished construction recently. You can't tell there was a fire here. It's one of my inhalers. I must have left this behind. This will be useful if my lungs ever need relief. Pick up the inhaler. And whoops. There is a document in these that I should read if I recall. Order forms. Records for overdue books and fines. Juicy gossip. I don't have time. Faculty re uh, records. For uh, records, sorry, for past librarians. And. Oh! It's jammed. They will pry it open with the right tool, which I don't have right now. That might be for later. I don't remember. Oh, we gotta read this first. A note written between teachers. Please be careful not to leave important documents lying around. I've moved them to the bottom filing cabinet drawer to keep them safe. Pick the display key. Now, if I recall. I don't think we can open that one yet, that drawer. I think that is truly for later, because I don't really have a tool for it yet. So I'll have to remember to try and come back here. <laughs> Which, if anyone knows how I play games, you know I won't remember shit. Alright, moving on. Because so, Amy has found a spooky place for us to do our thing thing. Unless, hold on. Is the tool somewhere here? 
I don't think so. I don't remember it being that. A memorial to those who died in the fire in 1991. There's a portrait photo of every student in the accident. So sad. All those people. It is sad. That's terrible. Can't even imagine how awful that must have felt for everybody. A note between students. Ugh, I hate it when Miss Richards takes away our phones. Seriously, now we have to write notes like we're cavemen. LOL, did you see that the bookworm and goth girl are hanging out now? No way! Kinda makes sense. I heard Vivian doesn't even have a cell phone, isn't that crazy? No wonder she hangs out with Amy. She doesn't see all the weird satanic stuff she posts. There's a drawing of Amy with devil horns and fire behind her. Ah, did they leave this here on purpose? Also, what are you, from like the fucking 1970s? Like, <laughs> how are you this bent out of shape out over some goth shit? Honestly. Ah, the, it's their problem. You just keep doing what you're doing, Vivian and Amy. You're way cooler than them. Alright, I cannot remember... Isn't there like a side path over here? Yes, okay. There she is. There's my girl. Hey, Vivian. Did you get that board? Oh, crap. I forgot Not to yet. bring the board. Still working on it. <laughs> like an idiot. Cool. I'll be here whenever you're ready. I got too caught up in teenage girl up. gossip, apparently. Ugh, you saw that? Oh. <laughs> well, whoops. <laughs> well, you're going to get teased about that forever. And I have a feeling you'll actually kind of like it. Anyway, let's go grab the Ouija board. The spirit board. If I open this place case. Whoop. And let's open this bad boy. I'll put this back when I'm done with it. Will you though? I wonder if that's a hint. I wonder if that's the game saying like, hey, this is how you get the good ending. <laughs> like it often is with these things. Alright, spirit board acquired. Now, where did Amy go off to? You know, you were literally just there. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Got the spirit board. Yes. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I love that she's a little more excited Welcome than she wants to admit. Vivian. Please take your seat, and we can begin. You know, I like to imagine that Amy is kind of like playing up Tonight, her goth girl creepiness into the world to impress Vivian. Supernatural. It wouldn't surprise Are me in the ready? slightest. I, I think so. Just nothing too creepy, okay? <laughs> Don't worry. I've got everything under control. Sure you do. Just do whatever I say. They always okay. do when they fuck around with the Ouija Good. boards and horror stories. Start. Go ahead and place the spirit board on the table. Sure thing. I wonder if Amy actually believes this kind of stuff. Alright. Wow. This thing looks even cooler up close. Weren't these things like okay. literally a yes. toy? <laughs> we have to set the right ambience. I'll light these first two candles. Oop. Now you light the other two. Oop. Okay, okay, easy. I'm gonna examine every item. Amy doesn't smoke. Did she get these just for the seance? I hope she doesn't smoke. But I also know that a lot of people start doing that very young. Ever actually done this before? Of course she hasn't. Well, not exactly, but I've read a lot about it. That's the same thing, oh, right? What book? No books, just trusty old internet forums. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, there's one last thing. What is that? It's a rose I found in my locker last week. I don't know how it got in there, but it's all burnt and old. Definitely not a weird. The feeling has something to do with the school fire. Wait, Amy, is that true? I know it sounds crazy, but just play along. It definitely it's won't backfire on anybody. But <laughs> do you think this is safe? Nope. <laughs> don't worry, Viv. If any ghosts actually show up, I'll protect you. Oh, uh, that's comforting. Okay. <laughs> Let's do this thing. 
Let's both put our fingers lightly on the planchette. Okay. Great. Just like that. Now repeat after me. With hands entwined and hearts aligned, we seek the realm of the undefined. With, With hands, hands entwined and hearts, and hearts aligned, we seek the realm of the undefined. Spirits unknown, let your presence be shown. Spirits unknown, let your presence be shown. That should be it. Yeah, that's all there is to it. If there are any spirits here tonight, we invite you to talk to us. Yeah, come have a chat. Come have a little uh, sit down and chat and gossip Spirit, a bit. Are you here with us? Are there any spirits here who wish to communicate? Please, show us a sign if you're here. What kind of sign would that be? I don't think this is working. Nope. There we go. What was that? A creaking Spirit. noise. Are you here with us? <gasps> Amy, was that you? <laughs> I like the spirit answers for. Her. I can't Assuming it's the spirit working. and she's not just fucking around. Spirit, who are you? Are you the one I hear following? I actually can't remember halls? if she's screwing around. I think she Wait, is. Wait, what? Amy, has something been following you around? Spirit, are you dangerous? Yes. Amy, I don't like this. I'm scared. It's going to be okay, Vivian. Take deep breaths. Yeah, everything's going to be fine. Amy, I want to stop. Amy? Are you okay? Amy, are you okay? Are you okay, Amy? Overlight the candles. Did you get hit by? Did you get struck by a smooth criminal? Whoops. Yeah, I'm not gonna light it with a love letter, alright? Here we go. As much as that letter no doubt sets a heart aflame. Bookcases have fallen over. That explains the loud banging noises. Yeah, there's definitely nothing to worry about here. You pick up the candle. Ah, light source. Sweet. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I don't remember exactly where it wants me to go first, but... Memorials to those who died in the fire of 1991. But something is wrong with all the portraits. I love that. They look like something out of the live. It's so cool. Anyway. It's also that thing I always say. Oh, that I'm always expecting to happen in, in horror games. Oh, God. I really hate that noise. Where I'm... Oh, up. I'm always a little afraid that portraits are going to change at some point. Like, suddenly. It's an old-looking desk. What's that doing here? Ah! Hey, Amy. I don't remember that. Amy? Oh. It's some sort of tunnel closed off by bars. What's that cold, bitter smell? Oh yeah, things are changing now. This is such a good start to the game. I love this. Okay. Be real cool about this. There she is. Amy?
<laughs> well, she seems to be in good spirits. Amy? Are you okay? I don't think so. Oh boy, whoop! And once again, the aliens have arrived. That's the same joke I said in the demo. <laughs> Alright. Might want to bounce now. Yeah, th this seems like a good time to get the fuck out of Dodge. Fire? Yeah, that is indeed a fire. Uh, I've gotta get out of here. Whoop. See, this is really well done. I love how organically it leads you in the right direction. And here we go. Off to adventure. Fear the spotlight! <laughs> I love this. Alright, we're entering uncharted territory now. From here, I have no idea. What's going to happen? Well, I have some idea. <laughs> okay. When something that more resembles a school now. Oh! Well, the entrance is gone, so that's fun. That's a lot of lo- oh, no, oh no, don't do this. Oh, fuck you. Can I please get a light source item? Flashlight? Candle? So Ooh. Wait, is this from- is this from back in the first demo? This seems slightly familiar. There are papers and textbooks scattered on the ground. Wait, is this right? Why are the pages dated 1991? Where am I? Or when am I? Wow, wow. Ooh, spooky. Welcome, my sweet. Ooh. Okay, you love dramatically closing shit behind me for sure. What's this? It's a statue of a girl with her hands reaching out. Why would somebody put this here? It's a payphone. If I can get out there, I can call Amy and see if she's okay. Yeah, if you have any actual cash on you. Because if, if this is a 1991 payphone, you're going to need some, some coins. And I, well, I guess cash is still very common in the U.S. Uh, it's much less common here now. Everybody just pays with cards, really. But uh, I have a hard time imagining her walking around with, I don't know, pennies and nickels and stuff in her pockets. Flyer. It reads, try out for the Phantom of the Opera this Friday. It will be the biggest show Sunnyside has put on yet. All experience levels are welcome to try. Will you be the next star at Sunnyside? Probably not, but it's worth an attempt. Okay, I don't think this was in the demo after all. I don't recognize any of this. A flyer for Phantom of the Opera Trials. Okay. Ooh, hello. There's a toolbox on the desk. I've actually only ever really watched one version of Phantom of the Opera, and it's the one with Jared Butler, I believe, which isn't very good, so <laughs> we'll see. Do I still have a keycard on me? No, I do not. Okay. So, um, I, mean, I mean, I know of the Phantom, obviously, because everybody knows of the Phantom through pop culture osmosis, but I don't know any details, really. What's this? There's a tube of welding glue in slot B34. 
Okay, guess I'm gonna need that later. A note between students. Hey, are you trying out for the play this Friday? No way! Heather is just going to get the lead again anyway. I overheard Chrissy practicing in the bathrooms. She sounded pretty good. Maybe she'll get the lead. The weird girl? As if. Plus, Heather always gets her way. Wow, okay. Oh. This looks like a grave. I don't love that. The faded headstone reads, Light of my life, fire of my heart. My sin, my soul. The rose is stuck on something. I can get get a better look if I dig it in the dirt. Oh, here we go. Need to find a way to pry open the fingers, which is why I need that toolbox, I imagine. Oh, I did not like that sound at all. Something over there. What do we have here? Note between students. We're going to hang out in the underground tunnels again. You in? No, duh. I heard there are spy holes into every class somewhere down there. Isn't that creepy? Gross. Let's find them. <laughs> okay, that's an attitude I can get behind. <laughs> Gross. Let's find them. Turlet. There's a tryout flyer soaked in water on the ground. There's also a diary page that reads, I'm so anxious about Friday. Phantom of the Opera is one of my favorite shows of all time. Heather was so angry when she found out I was practicing. I already don't have friends, and now everyone glares at me to stay on Heather's good side. I just want to be the star so maybe Raul will finally notice me. Oh. Okay, I'm seeing some parallels here already, so let's see what happens. Let's open this fucker up. Hello. The note says, Hey Dana, could you return the toolbox to the repair guy that came last week? He left in a hurry and forgot his stuff. Said he heard ghosts in the underground area. It must have been those kids again. You take the office keycard. Hell yeah. Progress is being made. Okay. So now that we have that, we can get in here. Swipe this bad boy. Mrs. Ives? Wow, she looks so young. Alright. Pleasant little place. Let's look around. Ooh. It's a note between teachers. Hey Dana, could you check if all the repair guy's tools are in the box? There should be pliers and a screwdriver inside. The toolbox password is 001. <laughs> wow. One, two, three, four, five. That's amazing. That's the same password I have on my luggage. <laughs> ah, that's a little space balls humor. It's an incident report that reads, Students involved, Heather Moore and Chrissy Castro. In the locker room, students witnessed Heather locking Chrissy in a bathroom stall. Heather kept the door blocked while other students dumped a bucket of water over Chrissy. Ew. Don't file this report. We don't want to deal with Superintendent Moore again. Budgets are tight enough as it is. Wait, wait, wait. Superintendent Moore? Let me read that again. Yep. Okay. Classic. 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 Her dad is the superintendent, so she can do whatever the fuck she wants. Wonderful. Love seeing that. Okay, we need the screwdriver for this. And... I'm gonna set you to 001. Boom. Open up, baby. Yes. Okay, what do we got? A pair of broken pliers. If I repair the broken pliers, I can take them. So that's what we probably need the glue for. Alright. I imagine. So far, the puzzles are pretty, like, one-to-one, -one, which I appreciate. Let's see if it stays that way. I mean, knowing me, I will run into some bullshit. That is super easy for everyone else, but I'm just stupid. I'm not the most handy person, but I can definitely use one of these. Yeah, screwdrivers aren't the hardest thing, so I think you'll be fine. Let's get the other one out. Heck yeah. Alright, open. Let's get in here. A note to the principal. I saw some kids trying to sneak into the tunnels again. Luckily, Crane was there and stopped them before they got hurt. 
He said it would keep an eye on the sewer entrance to make sure kids don't go in there. Something tells me we're going to go in there at some point. What do we have here? Nothing of interest. Wish I could read the whiteboard, but... All right. The window to the boys' locker room is open. Well, now. Look who's being a scandalous little bitch. <laughs> I'm joking, of course. Note between students. I can't believe Christy the weirdo has the guts to practice in front of me. Right? Who's she kidding? No way she's beating you, Heather. Totally. I'll make sure my dad talks to Mr. Crane just in case. I'm so jealous. Your dad being superintendent is so cool. Yeah, um, so not exactly superintendent, but I'm the son of a teacher. It's not cool. <laughs> I mean, I love my mom, don't get me wrong, but the thing is that, like, when you're in school and you go to the same school that your mom teaches at, you basically can't fart downwind without the entire faculty knowing. So, uh, yeah, not, not as great as it sounds, guys. For the record, she never actually taught any class I had. She made damn sure that didn't happen. So, uh, bonus points to her. Oh, hello, a drain. Is there something down there? I'm assuming. I have a feeling I know what's down there. There's something shiny inside the drain. Yep. We're getting a coin. Okay, so... Let's unscrew these. There we go. Oop. Got some coins. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why is there a fire now? Oh! Oh, there it is! That's Mr. Flashlight himself. Oh, spotlight. Sorry. Crap. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We gotta dodge this guy. Oh, oh. Where is he? Ah! Okay, run for it, run for it, run for it, run for it. Get through the window. Jeez. Yeah. What was that thing? That was a spotlight. It was also terrifying. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, okay, okay. We have quarters, so we can uh, we can advance a bit now. Let's see. Where was the vending machine? Here it is. Tube of welding glue in slot B34. Oh, I gotta insert the coin first. Right. Insert money? Yes, please. Yuck, they're covered in gunk from being in the drain for so long. B, three, four. Yes. Welding glue. Ah! Oh! I saw you there, you little freaky shit. That's a really good. That's a that's a nice little scare. I like that. Anyway, let's go fix up those pliers. How do they get broken, though? Let's see here. I definitely don't want to get any of this on my hands. Nah, man, if it's made to fix metal? Alright, we have pliers now. Which... Fuck, I've already forgotten where we need to use them. Back in the girls' locker room, I think. Oh, right, for this. That glue was like magic. It's totally fixed now. The pliers should do the trick. Oh, this is... Actually kind of creepy. <laughs> Ugh. Don't love this twisted-ass hand. Pick up the middle rows. Are they gonna reach out for me or something? Okay, I half expected a carry moment there, but... I guess it's not that predictable. Ooh. 
watch this. A love letter and a rose, huh? A burnt letter and rose. How did I never notice you before the audition? You're really something special. Your secret admirer. Oh, this is that Raul guy. No, 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 no. I already see where this is heading. No. Ah, I just shouted out Carrie. Okay, I don't know for sure. This is a prank. This is Heather and Raul trying to fuck with poor Chrissy. I'm like 90% sure that's where this is going. Oh man, I hate this. Like immediately. Okay. Let's pop in the rose. This thing is surprisingly heavy. Well, it's made of metal. Like... Oh! Okay. She seemed very happy about that. <laughs> Alright, fine. And there's the payphone. It is not going to help. The phone works. I should be able to call Amy. Price per call, 25 cents. Still covered in gunk, I see. Perfect. Amy's phone number is 555-0199. Hello? <gasps> Amy, it's Vivian. I'm so glad you're okay. Vivian, I'm relieved that you called. Oh? Are you safe? I've been searching for you. Of course I am, Viv. Oh, she doesn't Where sound convincing. I'm so confused. The school looks completely different and... I just finished getting ready. What? Please, tell me you'll make it to the theater to see me. Uh-oh. Getting ready? Theater? What are you talking about? Don't worry, Viv. Everything... Oh, yeah, she's, uh, she's ghost brain... Well then, all right, um, I didn't love hearing that. I gotta be honest. Where are we not? Oh, courtyard. Feels like, hmm. All right, what else we got going on around here? A school newspaper, cast list for Phantom of the Opera, starring Heather Moore, Raoul Rousseau, Understudies. Chrissy Castro, Andrew Brown. Oh! Chrissy made it to understudy. Huh. Can't imagine Heather being happy about that. God, I'm getting way too involved in this fucking high school drama here. A diary page. Of course Heather got the part. Mr. Crane sounded so excited after our audition too. Now Heather and Raul get to play the leads together. I don't stand a chance with him. Who am I kidding? I just have to settle for understudy. I mean, you know, wrench, kneecap. <laughs> there are options, is what I'm saying. <laughs> A note between students. Whoa, did you see they changed the underground tunnel entrance cover? Is this crazy looking lock? Uh, yeah, I heard Crane got it installed because we kept breaking in. What a bus kill. I mean, it sounded a lot like he's trying to make sure you stupid-ass kids don't kill yourselves. But then I'm a crusty old adult, so maybe I just don't get it, man. Oh. Not wild about the smoke coming from in there. So just two entrances? Hmm. Gotta look over here. See if there's some interesting stuff. It's Jumbo Air Conditioning Unit. It isn't making any sound. Oh. A strip of tape that reads, The power supply is connected to the gymnasium. How do I... The power light is off. I can't make those stay in place, so I probably need something. Some item. Let's look around. It's a metal placard. Gymnasium. 
Or maybe something in the gymnasium needs to be turned on before I can get in there. That's probably also an option. Um, okay, I guess we're just going in the gymnasium then. I don't think there's much else to see here. Unless, I should probably go see if I can even open that other door, which I don't think I can. Because, yeah, we need to clear that smoke, otherwise I'm going to die the instant I go in there. Weber Building, Theater. Okay, this is the climax area. The building is filled with smoke. No way am I going in there. I'll have to clear out the smoke before going inside. All right. Okay. Bully free zone. <laughs> yeah, good luck with that, assholes. Uh, I'm sorry, but like, as far as I'm concerned, most anti-bullying uh, campaigns I've seen in schools are misguided at worst and flat out just like bare minimum attempts at, at best. It's uh... I'm sure you can tell by now that I don't necessarily have good experiences with this shit. It's a display for students to take the pledge to stop bullying. A bunch of paper hands with students' names are glued on. A single hand is missing from the center of the board. A hand with the word Heather on it, perhaps? Ooh. What's this? Diary page. Someone left me a secret admirer note at a beautiful rose. I thought I saw Raul looking at me in class. Maybe he did notice me after all. It's it's a it's a carry scenario. I just know it's I just know it's gonna be a carry thing. Cause we found that note where it was all like, ew, she was practicing while I could see it. Ew. Bathrooms. If I find a way to raise the gate, I should get inside. Okay. Swimming pool area. Alright. I'll check all that out later. I just wanna get the lay of the land. Swimming pool area, sure. Ooh, mechanical. Oh, I actually can go in there. But I don't want to yet. I don't want to yet. I want to check out this room first. See if there's more to see. Can I check out more of this stuff? More of these displays? It doesn't look like it. It's... What? It's cool to be... Blind? Oh, it's cool to be kind. I saw the shades and I was like, it's cool to be blind. And I was like, I mean, obviously, yes. Blind people are awesome, like everyone else. But I was just kind of like, that's a bit of a weird poster. <laughs> okay, let's see what this is. It's a letter from the principal. Due to recent events, we are holding a mandatory anti-bullying seminar. This will remind students how they should behave at school. And it definitely won't give any of the bullies ample ammunition if anyone should actually take up the school's offer on telling them about their experiences. <laughs> no! Bullies couldn't possibly be that evil. Ugh. I'll try to control my ranting. An info board. Welcome to the bully free zone. Don't forget to enter our raffle and win a cool prize. There's some general information on bullying and how to prevent it. Yeah, sure. Let me guess. Ignore them. Try to be their friend. Realize they probably just have a terrible home life. Tell the nearest adults. As if any of those things ever fucking worked. Ugh. Anyway, let's see here. Oh! There's, there's the tombola. Let's check it out. It's a tumbler for a raffle. But it won't move because the hand crank is missing. What are the... Can I use... Aw, that would have been nice if you could just cheat it that way. But okay. Oop, hello. I didn't see this before. A pink paper hand, but somebody ripped it to pieces. The name Heather is written on it. Hmm. I knew it. I knew that was it. By the way, let me be clear. Yes, I do appreciate some effort being taken. I just have bad experiences with people making very, very bad faith attempts or barely trying when they do this. Like, I've, I've seen so many cases of this clearly only being done to make the faculty look good. Rather than because anyone actually gives two flying fucks. So, let's get to the mechanical room. 
power diverter. I'm not exactly sure what this is. Looks like if I flip the switch, I can turn on the HVAC panel. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait a second. I'm not gonna do that yet. I wanna look around. An ad for high velocity toilet flushers. There's a sticky note attached. Maybe this will help with those backed up toilets. That sounds gross. It's a note from the maintenance department. Hey Fred, we're a bit short staffed right now, so no one can train you. If the fuse box breaks, you need to replace the fuses. Everything else you need is right there in the fuse box. Jim. Okay, that looks important. I'm just gonna go right ahead and take a picture of this, because otherwise I will forget literally everything. Like the dumbass I am. So, let's just see. Alright, let's go. There we go. Okay, let's check out what else is here. What is this? You pick up the fuse. Ah, I need a couple more then. Let's see here. Password 3451. It's a sticky note with a handwritten message. Password is 3451. But this lock requires symbols, not numbers. Weird to have the solution like right next to it then, but all right. So that means three, four, five, one. Oop. Oh my God, there's a lot going on here. Um, I don't know how this works. What in the... Okay. This is immediately incredibly confusing. For your safety, if the switch appears locked, please repair the fuse box first. Okay, fair enough. So let's... The status indicator says the bathrooms are locked. Okay, so I need to... Right? Insert the fuse. So glad these are labeled. Oh, it's the- oh god, I thought it was some kind of like- Jesus. Um... So, what? Wait, how does this work? Okay. So... We set it to a hunt. Oh! Wait, that's not correct then. I don't understand. Oh! So... looks right though so what's the problem here I think I saw these same symbols on the multimeter on the left yes you did and I don't oh four my bad there we go okay and pull okay that's <laughs> that's a kind of interesting uh, way to do it Okay. Well then. Okay, so. Storage is open and bathrooms are open. I don't think I've seen storage. Yeah, I need to repair the whole fucking thing. Alright. I don't recall seeing storage though. Oh, I don't love that noise. Let's look around for storage. Is that back there? Can't get in there. Is that storage? That says storage, alright. Let's go. Let's see if we can find some items in here. Need a key to unlock the storage cabinet, alright? Oh. Oh dear. 
Should I approach this ghost first before I grab? Oh. They're gone. I like that, um, I like that these tools so far aren't like one and done things. Because of course there's more cases where you could use them. I'm just wondering where she keeps all this shit right- oh. Where she keeps all this stuff right now. Oh, I'm in the bathrooms, but... I thought I opened those, normally. Oh, jeez. The door won't budge. Hello? Are you okay in there? Do they seem okay? Oh, no! Oh, it's a shadow. I thought it was a noose for a second. You can't open it anymore. <laughs> this is creepy! I like this! Ew. You take the ring of cabinet keys. Alright. Oh. It's covered in blood. Ugh. Okay, so the girls was locked. I just... Oh! Oh, that's what was making that banging noise. Fair enough. And now we have an easy way out. Okay. Ooh, let's be scandalous and go to the boys' bathroom. Which is, no doubt, way more disgusting. <laughs> well, I'm already hearing those kinds of noises, so yes. Ew! I think I see something at the bottom. But I'm not reaching down there until I flush out that black sludge. Probably a good idea, honestly. Note between students. Raul totally has a crush on Chrissy, right? He's been staring at her in class. What? The quiet chick? No way! Nah. He's just planning some bullshit. At least that's my take so far. Okay, so I can't... I can't get that yet. But I do have a cabinet key now. So we can go back to storage. Get whatever was in there. I'm really into this so far. This is so fun. Um, I definitely see why the Silent Hill radio was in the cabinet now, because this is very Silent Hillish. Although with a lot less combat, which honestly, yeah, I'm fine with that. Oh, this uh really glad I found this. Yeah, no shit. Wonder what's in those cabinets. We're gonna find out now, aren't we? Another fuse. Hell yeah, baby. Which means I can open the pool area now. So I guess we'll have to switch back to... To the bathrooms later, so I can go in and get whatever's in that black sludge. Okay, let's open the pool area. Down here we go. And the pool area would be B. The gym is C. Okay, so... We gotta... Put this down here, and this in there. And then we open. Oh, I'm still missing one. Shit, where could that be then? Uh, okay, hold on. There was something about the toilets over here. Uh, we're a bit short-staffed. Use by bread. Maybe this will help with those backed-up toilets. High-velocity flusher. Huh. Hold up. Am I just an idiot who didn't realize there was a flush button? That's entirely possible. Let's go back. Hmm. 
Yep, sure enough. I was just a little too hasty. And there's the other fuse. Alright, I was a little too hasty there. Yeah, let's insert a wet fuse into a fuse box. No way, that could backfire. Oh no. Oh! Oh shit. Oh, he's coming closer, isn't he? Oh, the music is great. Do I just wait, or...? Oh, I have to sneak... I have to sneak back. Wait, I can't. Oh, fuck me, man. I think I did it. Woo. Oh god. Okay. Oh, he's co he's coming. And then I think we sneak back through here, right? Oh boy. Man, this game can be intense. God damn. Already got what I needed there. Okay. Let's go. Oh! Oh no. Oh, I don't like this guy. Fuck him. And the horse he rode in on, for that matter. Oh, Jesus! Oh, crap, crap, crap. Oh! Oh! Jeez! Oh, wait, oh, 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 did she headbutt him or something? I don't know, let's just get the fuck out of here. Ah, uh, wait, oh, he got her again. What does she do? Oh, she pushes him. He's a bit of a weenus, isn't he? Right, whatever, let's just... Quickly, quickly, quickly. Oh, man. That did not go well. Oof. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's an awful lot of inhalers in this game, so that's kind of a problem. Right. So... So, 80. Alright. And that opens the pool and the office. Don't remember seeing an office door. So now the real question is, is he still out? By the way, do I have to save? No, I think it autosaves. Oh, yep, he's still out here. Let's just go to the pool area quickly. Oh, fuck off. Both of them? Okay, well. I don't remember seeing an office door, though. I'm sure we'll find it. Maybe it's past the pool. Yeah, it's blocked there. Hmm. Okay. Lifeguard chairs. Quite a few. Oh, jeez. Uh, 
Uh, a sign that reads, caution, wet floors. High risk of slipping and, for and falling. No horseplay tolerated. What do we have here? I need to open the latch before I can open this gate. Uh. Yuck, no way am I going down there. I've got to drain the black goop before I climb in. Sounds sensible enough to me, honestly. Oh, the phone in the office is ringing. Oh, jeez. Do I really want to know? Do I really want to pick this up? I don't get the option to, so... Fuck me. Alright. Hello? Oh, it's Amy. Hey. Amy! Do you really think I'd date you, Viv? Oh, jeez. I know about that sad, sappy letter you wrote me. You don't even have the guts to say it on my face. Well, aren't you being cool? No. No, wait. I know this isn't you, Amy. Just go home, Viv. I'm happy here. Oh, I'm sure you are. <laughs> so happy. So happy. Well, that was mean. I'll save you, no matter what. Even if you do hate me. Oh, don't believe her, Viv. It's a sticky note. Password reminder, the year both teams won gold. Oh, that's over there, then. It's an incident report about a student who was injured. Heather slipped while on a diving board and broke her leg. She stated there was an oily substance in the diving board that caused her to slip. Unfortunately, we could not find evidence of the substance. We believe it was an accident. Ooh. Interesting. Did Chrissy do something bad? Okay, we don't have the password yet. Need a key to unlock the storage cap. Oh, hold on. Yeah, look at me go. Oh, hell yeah, extra inhaler. <laughs> I really need that. Got a fuse. We need a second one, though. Okay, the year that both teams won gold. Ugh, sports trophies. All right, I'll take a look. Girl swim team, gold, 1980. Girl swim team, silver. Girl swim team, bronze. 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 Girl swim team, gold. Girl swim team, gold. Okay, so boy swim team, gold, 1991. And girl swim team, gold, 1990. 1980. Gold, 1987. So, yep, 1987. That's the password. Thank you. Pick up the pool pump handle. All right, that sounds good. Let's see where we can drain this fucker. Where's the pool pump? Probably in there somewhere. Wait, hold on. Where's this? Oh yeah, we don't want this. Spotlight head seems to be gone though, so that's cool. Alright, pool pump. Where's the pool pump? Didn't love that noise, whatever that was. Pool pump, pool pump, where are you, pool pump? Not there. Ah, upstairs, probably. I haven't been up here, so... These are audience seats, but that's probably the pump right there. Oh, another inhaler. Hell yeah. Give me that shit. And note between students. Did you see that crazy accident with Heather slipping on the diving board? They're being really careful here now. Mr. Fitz even shut off the drain pump and put the valve in his office. Yeah, okay, so... That was just a hint for if I went up here first. Okay, let's see. It's a missing handle. Examine. This will make it easier to use the pump. I mean, it'll make it possible to use the pump is what you mean. 
let's drain this shit. And it's just like full of corpses, like in freaking poltergeist. You moved the headstones, but you didn't move the bodies! Anyway, let's get down. Oh god, that is deep! What the hell kind of school swimming pool is this? Dude, what? Okay, I think there might be some supernatural tomfoolery afoot here. Oh, okay. A burnt letter and rose. Dear Chrissy, understudy no longer. It's your turn to shine. Your secret admirer. Oh, okay. It's starting to look like my uh, my assumption about Raul was wrong. I don't think he would do that for Heather. Pick up the raffle crank. Okay. It's probably where the last where the last fuse is. Yeah, no, no. Because they would... Oh! My theory was that they were collaborating, so that... Ah! No. Oh, boy. He is a-coming. I don't love that. Oh, stay away, stay away. Okay, quickly. Behind this, behind this, behind this. Ah! And then, quickly, out, 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 out. Boy, he's persistent. Number, uh, it's time for raffle, but it won't move because the hand crane missing. Okay. Da 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 Yes, it's covered in blood! Hooray! Why, though? Oh, I love that it keeps spinning for this. That sound is delightfully creepy. Okay. So. This is a weird freaking system, though. Get in there. Whoops. Oh, one. Straight up just one? Okay. And that should open the gym. Turn that thing on. That means there's no power in this. Is that it? I guess the HVAC system should have power now. Oh. Posters for Amy. Amy Tanaka. Huh. They quickly slink away into the shadows, huh? Hmm. Alright. Not super wild about this. Okay, let's see here. Oh, right, right. Back here. <clears throat> Sorry. That ought to clear the smoke. Yeah, there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Smoke in the building is cleared out. Uh oh. 
but something is still burning though. Not wild about that. Anything else here I gotta see? No? Can't look through any windows. That must be the theater Amy was talking about. But it's pretty on fire right now, so. We haven't had to use the pliers again, though. I'm just waiting for that to happen. One of these times, there's gonna be something terrible behind one of these vents. I just know it. Okay, let's see. What do we have in here? A counselor incident form. A few students were bullying Chrissy in the arts hallway, but Raul stopped the fight. Both students were counseled on the situation and are back in class. So glad the anti-bullying assembly had an effect. Okay, so the game really wants me to think right now that Raul, like, fell for Chrissy after all and is trying to help her, but, uh... I don't think I believe that. I'm not sure what else happened, but I don't think I believe that. Some degrees framed for the school counselor. Okay. Is there anything else? Nope. I think we got everything in here. Okay. So... Oh. The spotlight head gonna step... Oh, we got sprinklers. We gotta turn those on. Okay. Cool. That's good. What the fuck is this? Oh! Oh! Well, that's interesting. Hold on. Oh, that was that crazy lock they were talking about with the tunnels! Oh! Okay, I'm not going down there just yet. Gonna explore these other parts of this building first. Yeah, that's too heavy. Uh, Wait, what do... What do you think you can use to lift that shit? Yeah, no, I don't have a tool for that right now. Can't get past the fire. Um... That's where it just came from, I believe, right? Yeah, counselor's office. So let's go through here. Doors to the hallway are locked. Don't have a key for that. So, that's probably in the tunnels. Hip hooray. Love going down there. Oh, this is... this is nasty. You again? The bust is cracked and the face is missing. You take the hallway keys from the statue's hand. There's an inscription. Fire of my heart, never shall we part. Okay. I have a feeling I gotta find that face for some reason. what that will do, though. Okay. Let's sneak around. This looks like where we started after we played with the Ouija board. What's this? Drama class. Well, that seems appropriate. Probably go. Oh, anything back here? No items or anything. Okay. Yeah, we should we should go in here. So, okay. A note between students. Raul, thank you for standing up for me last week. I'm really excited to be in the play together. 
Mr. Crane says I need extra acting lessons, so I have to stay late after school with him most days. But maybe we can practice together sometime on the weekend? Chrissy. Mm. Alright, let's see. Degrees and awards. This teacher must have been really serious about theater. What's going on with this rug? Ooh, hello. It's a big metal hatch with a strange keyhole. Yeah, I can't do anything with that. Alright. Starting to have some, like, multi-layered puzzles here. I'm already starting to lose track of where what is. It's some kind of construction contract. Description of work. Installation of a prop chandelier. Client requests the chandelier to be installed hanging over the stage. Oh, this is a recipe for disaster already. Three ropes were used to secure the fixture. If you understand the risks, please accept this agreement. Oh, fuck me. I think I'm starting to see how the fire started. Oh, man. Come on. That just sounds like it's begging to go wrong. Lovely little stage, though. Little practice stage. Okay, so we know there's a latch there. Found a note. Um, yeah, there's nothing else here. Okay. Don't love that the drama classroom has a secret hatch. God only knows what's down there. Oh, what's this? Oh, that was more lockers. Wait. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> I fucked that up. Alright. Past drama class. Class. Sorry. I don't know how I said it like that. Drama class. Another one of these. Huh. I don't have a tool for that yet, though. this music class. Alright. Let's take a look around. A note between students. Do you see Raul and Chrissy are hanging out together now? Isn't that because they're both leads in the play? Well, I see them giggling together and passing notes in class. Feels more like than just friends. Ha! Way to go, weird girl. You must be one of the most popular boys at school. I'm sure he is. Uh, I can plug in cables, but I don't have them. I also don't have a VHS tape. Oh. This better not be anywhere near as complicated as the fucking Silent Hill one, because I'm going to get mad. And notice poster. New practice schedule for Phantom of the Opera. All orchestra students participating must attend each session. Okay. I don't see any piano hints in here, which is weird, because this is the music class. Oh, wait, here's something. Oh, so the other one was the new one. Go back. Read this. Is it me or has practicing for this new play been really intense? No, we've all been feeling the stress. The drama teacher has been micromanaging everything. Ugh, I can't wait till this play is over. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no, a theory is forming in my head that I don't like. Well, we'll see. Um, I came from back there, so let's move on a bit. Another classroom there. What class is this? This is art class. Okay, I think I remember this room from the first demo, or something similar to it at least. Hmm. 
Ah, there's stuff back there. We'll check on that in just a bit. I just want to make sure I explore every corner first. Hello. A painting of a couple holding hands. It looks like somebody's watching them in the distance. A diary page. I can't believe it. Raul asked me to be his girlfriend. We made it official and bought promise necklaces at the mall. Now kissing him on stage will be even more romantic. There are hearts drawn all over the page. Oh, hey, a crank. Cool, now we can start doing shit. Yeah, I'm just gonna carry that in my back pocket. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, we have a jack now. Oh, fuck off. Oh, no. Wait, how am I gonna get out now if the entrance is on fire? Crap. Okay, I can hide here for a bit. Oh, no. The whole place is fucking burnt. Ah, crap! Out of here, out of here, out of here, out of here, out of here. Does fire just kind of follow this guy? Wait, does he follow me in the halls? No. Okay, I'm not doing super hot on health, so that sucks. I'm not good at avoiding this guy, I gotta say. Mostly because I like... I feel like I don't really get time to uh, explore. Figure out where to go for stuff. Okay. Nice. Okay. I just don't want to use an inhaler yet. I want to use it when I'm almost dead. Oh, toilets. Okay. Ooh, another one. How could you break my heart? He will just hold you back. I won't let him ruin our special night. Oh, no. Yeah, I, I know exactly where this story's going now. Okay, my carry assumption was wrong. This is going somewhere way worse. God damn it. What? Was that noise? What's going on with this mirror? Looks like it was hung up differently from the others. Hello. You pick up the face piece. A diary page. I got another admirer letter. I thought Raoul was my admirer, but now I'm sure it isn't him. I'm so scared. I feel like I'm constantly being watched. I should show this letter to Raoul. Up. Oh, bye. Uh, well, we got a face piece. That's not really enough, though. No, son of a bitch. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Okay, be careful here. Be real freaking careful. Can I hide? Oh, oh he disappeared. Oh, oh, no, no, under the table, under the table. Oof. Shit all over both of my nuts. All right. Let's get out of here. Let's just pop that face piece in right away. Just so it's done. So I don't forget about it. Nope. Stop. It feels like it's looking at me. So, are we talking about three pieces or one? Or two? Well, whatever. We'll find out. I just figured I might as well pop it in on the halfway, so... Okay, let's use our friend the crank. Or the jack, as it's actually called.
I do like that you have to do most things manually with your mouse. Um, but not in like an overly intrusive or overly specific way. It makes sense, it's easy, and it's over with quickly. So, that works for me. Okay. So... Trophy case. It's when the other half of the school now. Watch this. Digital media. All right. Sounds like an interesting class. What's this? A message on the screen says, "Please insert disk to save file." Hmm. Okay. A poster. Transparency printers are now available for use. You can print out transparencies used for overhead projectors. Use the designated computer for printing when you have a file ready. Print it for projector seats. Print it okay. I don't remember seeing a projector in the other classrooms, but I guess there'll be one here. Well, somewhere around here. But I need a disk first. Printer is ready. Please insert disk to print file. Use the computers in this table to print documents. Okay, I don't have a document disk either. So this room is for printing some shit I need. Okay, interesting. This is literature class. Alright. God, I remember overhead projectors from back when I was in school. <laughs> What is this? Oh. Alright, that's a slightly more complicated one. A note between students. Dude, people have been freaking out since Raul went missing. Yeah, Chris has been in the media room printing all those posters. It's so sad. Do you think she could have done something? No way, she's so depressed. Maybe he ran away to get away from her. Haha. <laughs> wow. Yeah, man, fuck these kids. All right, here's the overhead projector. Interesting. I don't have anything to put on it, though. Hmm. Okay. We don't have one of those yet. Student delinquency slip. Student name Raul Rousseau. Unexcused absences. Have not been able to make contact with student. Yeah, that doesn't sound like absences. That sounds like he's fucking dead. Okay. Uh, doesn't seem like there's much of any items in here. Except for in this thing. Which I can't solve yet. So then where do we go? Down here? Oh, there's a long hallway. Fuck off. Oh, jeez. Huh? Okay, quickly. Biology lab. Sure. A school announcement. All students must return home if you are not involved in an after-school activity. For your safety, please follow these rules. Do not talk to strangers and walk together in groups. If a stranger approaches you, just say no. Ah, that always works. What the fuck? <laughs> um, okay. It's a little strange. It's a lot strange, actually. The Oh. A small dissected bird. The organs look pristine. For our next project, we will be dissecting a lovebird. Lovebirds are known for choosing one mate for life. If we break their heart, will they be able to move on and find a new mate? What the fuck? Oh, boy. Yeah, I... I think my theory is starting to get a little more solid, and I don't like it. 
try not to say too much just yet. Okay. Can we untie this? We sure can. Upsetting, but okay. The cage was damaged in the fall. There's something wrapped around the mannequin's wrists. I can bend the bars with the right tool. That would be this. Oh, it's the AV cable. What a weird display. But okay, now I have now I have cables. But I don't have a tape to use with the cables. I suppose I'll find that further down here. Oh jeez, it is following me. I didn't even see what classroom this is. Oh, it's a storage. Sure looks like a storage, media storage or something. Okay, yeah, they have various players here, so this is probably where we find a VHS tape. Oh, I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get chased by project... Uh, by spotlight head in here, I think. Oh, fuck. Alright, alright, alright. A diary page. Without Raul, I feel so broken. Why am I still in the play? I only auditioned because I wanted him to notice me. And now he's gone. There's no point in doing the show anymore. I'm telling Mr. Crane today that I quit. <laughs> you pick up the VHS tape. Mm hmm So now I have to go all the way back. Oh, shit. I just know Spotlight Head is gonna pop up in here because it's so perfectly mace like for it. Or not? <sighs> Son of a shit. I knew it. Oh no. No. What just happened? Something fell over. Pick up the strange key. Let me see. Keep forgetting what these are called. I don't even remember seeing anything we could use that on. Oh! Okay. I don't love this. What happened to you guys skittering away every time I get close? Alright. Oh shit. Oh. I wish you could like lean out. Uh oh. There's a hole in the ceiling for some reason gonna see me in here? Oh. Follow, 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 follow. Quickly, 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 quickly. Nope, that's... Nope. Shit. No! Hopefully that helped avoid it for a second. Oh boy! Ah! Quick! Run. Oh boy. Okay, run, 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 run. We just gotta get out of here. Just gotta get back to the... Fuck, which room was it that had the TV in it? Hmm. Oh, crap. Okay. Ow. Ow. Did I just get set on fire? I didn't realize it could, like, blast its way down here. Okay. Well, it sure can. 
So that's a ton of fun. Okay, let's just get into a classroom. Don't even care which. Which one has the TV in it? Not in here. I think it might have been the music class. Oh no. These are the bathrooms, so it's definitely not in there. They're timed. That's good to know. <laughs> ah! Fuck me! Okay, I was like one second too early. Fuck you. There's the TV. Yeah, okay. God, I need more inhalers soon. <laughs> right. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Weird that they're moved around like that, but sure. And then pop in the tape. Oh, fuck. Just the three. Nope, it's longer. Okay, I gotta, I gotta record this. Cause I'm, I'm so bad at these types of. Okay. So that means it's. It's this one and two over. No, wait, I fucked it up. All right, so. Yeah, okay, there we go. Another face piece and another inhaler, thank God. What is this? A diary page. I tried telling Mr. Crane that I quit, but he wouldn't accept it. He said I couldn't quit the show and that it was my time to shine. It sounded just like a letter I got. Oh no. <laughs> it's going where I think it's going. What is this for, though? Hmm. And I still haven't found any, like, overhead sheets or anything like that. So that really sucks. Um... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot about the latch in here. That has to be what the key is for, right? Yes! Totally forgot about this. See? I told you I'm an idiot. Oh boy. Further down. Why not? What is this? Like a secret library or something? This is a placard with a name on it. It's too old and faded to read. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. What do we have here? You pick up the blank floppy disk. Cool. I guess that's all I needed down here? Oh. Ghost kids are back. Hello. Can I read the name there now? Nope. Guess that's all there was to find down here. Alright, cool. Um, 
You gotta get back up. I love that you uh, included the old school thing from like Silent Hill and Resident Evil where, whoops, where she turns to look at things that are important. That's really cool. That's very nostalgic for me. Get out of here. Right on. Go down and pop in the second part of the stone face. Mm -hmm. Pop that fucker in. Still needs the right side. Okay. Okay. And in here we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Right, that's the one that has this, but I don't have a solution to this yet. So, we'll have to fuck around with that later. We gotta get to the digital media class, if I can remember where the fuck that is. I think that was all the way back here. I'm just running and hoping for the best. Biology lab. Um, that's where we found the bird being dissected and the AV cables. I don't think there's anything else to gain in here. So let's move on. Audio visual. I can't go in there. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Why could I not go in there? It doesn't even give me a chance. It doesn't even... Huh. Why is it here then? Alright. Gotta go back and find the digital media class. Whatever the hell that is, I don't remember. The school is fairly easy to navigate, by the way, which I definitely appreciate. Uh-oh. There it is. I mean, I don't always remember where everything is, but, you know. Let's investigate this. Examine. I've never used one before. Well, I mean... Okay, hold on. So... Uh, printer is ready. Insert disk with data to print file. This one over here was saving a file. So... Pop in the floppy. Document is being saved to disk. Please wait. Oh. Oh no. Um, oh! Oh, piss off, man. I'm taking that. being very uncool about this. Ah! Fire! No! Fuck me! And I died. Oops. Leave 
least it doesn't take me back super far. Okay, so I gotta be faster. What an interesting segment of the game this. So he really can't see anything if it's not in his direct spotlight side of it, uh, line of sight, huh? That's cool and interesting. Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. Yes. And... No! Fuck! Quick hide. Document is printing. Please retrieve from printer. Yeah, but I need him to go the fuck away for- Oh, God! I mean, how? The fire spreads too fast. Wait, the fire follows him. Oh! I thought the fire was just, like, spreading. And that I couldn't do a thing about- It follows his footsteps. Oh, I didn't realize that at all. That's super cool, actually. Okay. So that's why you can't just run behind him or something. Okay, let's see. Oh, I can't get out. He leaves some fire. Yeah, look at that. The fire does actually, like, follow him. Wow, I'm, I'm stupid. To nobody's surprise, I'm fucking stupid. Shit! Okay, he has gotten a lot harder to avoid all of a sudden. Which is, uh, frustrating. Over here. Duck. Duck under the table. Quickly. Where does he go now? Uh, pop in the disc. There he comes. I gotta get to the printer. What's his route like? Okay, I think he's actually not going near me now. Fuck! What? Are you serious, man? Ah, dicks. This part is way harder than it looks, I promise you. Just get out. Get out, get out, get out fast. Oh no, there's still the ceiling flashlight. Man, I'm burning through my inhalers. I really don't like that. Oh shit. Okay, now we gotta get to the literature class. Which is like right over here. Boy, I don't love that I just burned through two of my inhalers like that. I'm terrible at everything. Okay, so... Whoever wrote this must have been heartbroken and angry. Oh, okay. Let's see here. Like this? Okay, I think I've got something here. Love blooms in bright light. My cage hides in the deep dark. Curtain rises at dusk. Betrayal came before the show start. Hold on. I want to read the rest, if at all possible. Do you not understand? What? Do you not understand? Imagine love blooms of roses. I will... Imagine... Lovely blooms of roses I will shower you with. But in just... I can't read all, all of this. 
Your beauty glows in the bright light of others who look at you. I think? But no, but your beauty glows in bright light, but others too. I wish this was a little clearer. I actually kind of want to see what this says. Um, wait, can we? Hold on. No, we can't mess with it anymore. Ah, I kind of wanted to read the whole thing, but it's a little too dark. Anyway, let me see again. Love blooms in bright light. My cage hides in the deep dark. Curtain rises at dusk. Okay, so... Love blooms in bright light. Uh... The cage at dusk? Hold on. My cage hides in the deep dark. Curtain rises at dusk. Betrayal came before the show's start. In the deep dark. Betrayal came before the show's start. But when did the show start? Oh. Shortly before dusk, I guess. Final face piece? Sure looks like it. A diary page. Opening night will be my chance to find out if Mr. Crane is hiding something. While he's busy, I'll take his bag and see if I can find anything about Raoul. I hope I'm wrong about everything. Oh, man. Well, that's creepy. Alright. Oh, crap. Alright, let's just go. And I guess... Repairing this thing turns on the sprinklers for some reason. Wonder how it broke. Good question, but now it's repaired. Oh, look, all better. Where does this lead, I wonder? Hmm. Somehow this isn't less creepy. Um, is this some kind of like secret hideout? Zone one, zone two, zone four. What do you mean zone? Water conduit failure detected. Zone one is off. Hmm. Okay. An expensive looking home stereo. Did someone live here? Oh, thank God, another inhaler. Um, it's a utility tunnels map with notes written all over it. Usual hangout spot. Enters at 8 a.m. Uses bathroom in electives hallway. Oh, God. Zone 1. It's a video feed of a dressing room. Really, dude? Video feed of the theater entrance. Zone 3. It's just static. Zone 4. The girls' locker room. Oh, dude! No. <laughs> no. Well, that went exactly where I went, and it's gross. Not, not where I went, where I thought it was gonna go. God damn it. Red envelopes. Stack of blank paper. Some diagrams for a stage play. There's an ornate chandelier hanging over the stage in positions for all the actors. Disposable camera with no pictures remaining. Shriveled roses. They were probably really pretty ones. F completely empty photo albums. Aw, oh, man. Oh, this is nasty. All right. Nothing to see here. I don't suppose... Nope. So I don't have a key for that. Just yet. A sewer tunnel. It's collapsed and totally blocked. Looks like the bars were sawed off at some point. Should I be messing with this first? I don't think so, because I don't have a solution to that puzzle. Let's go look at it really quick. Looks like I was missing something else. 
Intricate sets of pipes that root water. There's a missing pipe that needs to be replaced. Okay. So we do need to explore further down here first. Boy, all this just to turn on some sprinklers. <laughs> what is... Hmm. Alright, let's explore that in a moment. Oh, well, let's explore it now then. <laughs> There's a hole in the wall here. Looks like someone dug it from this side. I can crawl through. have a dressing room. All right. A pile of photos. They're all of the same person. A small promise necklace. A diary. I did it. I went through Mr. Crane's bag. There was a small key and some photos. All of me. I feel sick. One of the photos was taken from where the mirror is in this room. I know there's an opening behind it. The show is about to start, but I need to find out what's behind there. I hope I can find Raul. Oh, jeez. Some old dresses and costumes. They're beautiful, but covered in dust. My star. Tonight is our night. All the pain will have been worth it. Ew. Um. So this is cool and everything. But it's not a missing pipe. And it's not a solution to the next puzzle. So... Can't open this bag. Or so oh, there's the key. Prison cell key. Oh no. Wait, there was a cell back here? I did not notice a cell door. But then I could just be an idiot. Oh wait, I did. I just forgot about it immediately again. Like the dummy I am. It's like right over here, man. What are you, stupid? The answer is yes. Can't believe there's a prison cell like this right under our school. And there probably isn't, because this seems like a combination of the actual school in 1991 and some kind of hell version of it, based on this creepy-ass drama teacher. And his thoughts. Small cut. It's old and dirty. It has a smell I can't quite figure out. Probably urine. And feces. And or blood, considering everything. Well, okay, maybe not urine and feces, because there's actually a toilet in here, much to my own surprise. And a shower. There's the pipe. And the other half of the promise necklace. Oi. Oh, jeez. Curiously, she doesn't notice the other half of the necklace. Uh oh, music stop. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm gonna need you to shut the fuck up. Let's pop in this pipe. I don't want to hold on to this. Well, don't. Pop it in. Okay, so... Zone 2 is off. I'm assuming... That... We have to do it like this. Pump active. Status normal. Zone 2. And that should indeed clear it out. Whew, this is starting to feel endgamey. But let's see what other surprises it can throw at me. This school was definitely completely remapped from the first uh from the first demo, because like I feel like there were different puzzles in the demo, and you definitely it was definitely more like a school with a few classrooms where you had to go back and forth and avoid the guy at the same time. 
But this is a lot more restrained in that regard, which I appreciate. Okay, this looks familiar somewhat. Another poster of Amy. Come see our new star, Amy Tanaka, on stage now. Up, oh, electrified water. That's a classic. We don't want to step on that. To put it mildly. Same shit, right? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, careful, 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 careful. Another inhaler. We love to see it. And a note between students. I'm so glad Amy replaced Chrissy for the show. Chrissy didn't understand Crane's vision. She was too obsessed with her dead boyfriend. Yeah, what a loser. At least they're together now. I'm glad that Chandelier crushed her. She deserved it. That can't be real. No, no, that's how he sees the situation now. He found a replacement. Oh, God. Oh, things are burned down here. Don't love that. That's a bad sign. <laughs> Hi! I don't think I want to go in there. But I don't have a choice. Isn't that lovely? Here we go. More electric water. Ah, I guess it goes for a little longer than I thought. <laughs> I love how much she looks like Daria. It's really funny to me. <laughs> There's Amy. Amy? I can't believe I actually found In a birdcage. Why not? I'm coming to get you. Hold on just a little longer. I'm coming to get you, Barbara. <laughs> oh, crap. Okay, so I guess the challenge now is to find a route through this without sapping myself. Ah! Okay, I gotta get to that. Okay, I need this spotlight to move back over there. Yep. Out of my way. And then real quickly... Do I go around back there? No. So where does it want me to go? And duck. Oh! Through here. Okay. Where'd it go? Away from me at least. And duck under here. Yeah. And go away, please. Cool. No, no, that's still electrified. Okay. Shit. Um, I don't see a transformer here, though. Oh, I gotta crawl behind that, I think. Okay, so... Duck... Hear it. Yeah, I gotta go all the way around. Cool. Move, move, move. Shit, how do I get to that? Without dying. Oh, I think there's another transformer back there. Spotlight to go away, please. Thank you. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Yes. We duck under this real fast. Oof. Almost went wrong. And under here, too. And under here. And we should be able to get over there, yeah. Boy, you are in like the worst position here. 
I'm gonna need you to move again. here. Just be sure I don't get surprised by this thing. Okay, move, move, move. And run. As fast as your stumpy little legs can take you. They're not stumpy. I'm being mean. That's her, all right. Don't worry. I'll get you out of there. It did say three ropes, right? Yep, three ropes. I don't think that's quite how a knot works, but okay. That might have hurt. Amy, are you okay? My head. Where are we? Where's the library? Pretty far you from here. Remember what happened? Kinda. We were playing with the spirit board, but then you actually contacted the spirit got blurry and I started dreaming about a monster that locked me up in this place. That wasn't that real! This is all real? I'll catch you up later. First, we have to get you out of here. Uh-oh. Stuff is happening. You're not taking her away from me. I won't lose her again! What? It's that thing. The one that put me in here. I'm not quite sure what it just turned what into. What are we gonna do? I have to end this for good. It's the only way we can get this thing to stop. But how though? Be careful, Viv. Mess him up. <laughs> Those are two conflicting How statements. Do this? I have no idea. Oh. 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 Okay. Okay. Oh. Ow. Is that the trick? Are we gonna. Make it jump into the electrified pools? That seems to be it! That seems to be what we're going for. Okay. Uh. -oh. Get away. Away from it. What's happening? Fire spreading, but what's happening? Where oh! <laughs> Alright, come get me, buddy. Come jump in the electric water. Come on, come get me. Okay. Okay. So 
so how do I make sure to get away in time? Like... There we go. This is an interesting way to pull off a boss fight in this game, honestly. Okay, screwdriver. I love that these tools remain useful the whole time. That's so cool. Okay, but I I don't have anything to fuck up his um his lamp with though. Oh boy. I gotta move, I gotta move. But maybe the implication is that like that I can just break it. Drop here. Yes! I need something hard to stab the glass with. I mean, the screwdriver, right? Boom! 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 Come on. Yeah, eat all of the shit. Oh, what's that? Was it barfing out? Amy's free! Vivian! Aww. Holy crap. You did it! You killed that thing. That is pretty badass. <laughs> Let's not lie. Let's not kid ourselves. Did I really beat him? Is you he sure gone? did. Let's not stay around and find out. We gotta get out of here. Oh crap, oh crap. Yeah, we gotta leave. I was mildly distracted for a second. I thought it was a cutscene. <laughs> My bad. Yeah, just just go. Just run for it. Don't don't mind the fire. I've done this before. All right, let's get the fuck out. Whoop. Do you have any idea where I'm going? Anywhere we School's here? out for summer. School's out for ever. Whoa, not this way. Oops. Nope. Nope. Apparently not. Thank God you know how to pick locks, huh? No more pencils, no more books, no more teachers, dirty looks. Let's get the fuck out of here. And the moral of the story is never break into a school library. <laughs> it seems like a bad idea. Where are we? We're back. We're back. We made it. I can't believe it. We're really back in the library. Amy, are you okay? Do you remember anything that happened? I don't remember much. That's probably that for the best, crash, honestly, because that was that was creepy. Hazy after that. I don't know what that thing wanted. Oh, nothing good, I assure you. I was so scared. With good reason. Thank you for coming after me. I don't think I would have made it out without you, Amy. You most likely wouldn't I was have. I'm so scared too. Scared I'd never see you again. Scared I wouldn't be able to tell you. Go on. All night? I've been wanting to share something with you. I even wrote it all down because I was afraid to say it, but... I'm done being afraid. <sighs> I mean, you faced way worse over this evening, I so... I like you. You know... In that way. Come on. Yeah, there we go! I'm sorry, but I'm straight. <laughs> I'm s no, I'm sorry. I'm joking. To impress you. 
I wanted you to like me so badly. Because I feel the same way. Aww. But you're the one who's impressive. <laughs> Even more than I already knew. Now let's get the hell out of here. Yep, that sounds about right. <laughs> no. No? I mean, yeah, let's go. But no, don't say it like that. Put put the spirit board back? Maybe. Can we avoid anything spooky from now on? Fuck no, I still have half a month left. <laughs> I mean, definitely no more spirit boards. But is a scary movie okay? Uh, it depends. How scary? I think you can handle a scary movie after this. Okay, come on, give me the sequel hook. Or are we actually just gonna go with a straight happy ending? Straight happy ending! Hey, that's so rare to see in these stories. I love it. That was awesome. This was, aside from one moment where I wasn't entirely sure what to do and then I remembered like immediately, this was perfectly paced. All the puzzles made perfect sense within, you know, the context of everything. Nothing was ever, like, out of the blue moon logic. It's a very sweet story. Um, you do some nice diversion at the beginning, making me think... Because, like, I was completely convinced that this would be a, a carry... Oh, hold on. We want to share our deepest gratitude to you for playing Fear the Spotlight. The two of us poured our hearts into creating this game, and even though it's not perfect, it's pretty close! We couldn't be prouder of what we achieved. So thank you, thank you, thank you. We really appreciate that you trusted us with your time to play our game. We sincerely hope that you experienced even a little bit of the joy we had while making it. With deep appreciation, Brian and Krista, Cozy Game Pals. No, you got pretty freaking close to nailing it. There is very little here I can think of that should be different. Like, at all, really. Um, I clearly never quite uh, grasped how to get out of this spotlight's <laughs> uh, view. Um, but oh well, that's that's on me for being an idiot. I really love this. This was so good. There might be an argument to be made for making a slightly harder version with slightly more involved puzzles and a slightly more aggro enemy. But I actually really appreciate that he wasn't like stalking the hallways at all times. Because that would get very annoying very fast if you had to sneak between every room every time. So many games do that. Where just going back to grab a thing you need for a puzzle becomes super annoying. Because you had to deal with somebody stalking the halls and, you know, dying instantly anytime you mess up and then having to do it over. This completely averts that. There's always a way to get past with relative ease. I like that. I, I cannot praise this enough. This is probably the best game I've played this month so far. God damn. Actually, oh, hey, hold on. There's more. I've got one more thing I want to do before we go. <laughs> okay. Don't take too long. If there's a sequel hook, I'm, I'm actually really happy with the, uh... Oh. Oh, yeah. Right. First of all, we can't put the key back, but we can open this drawer now. I almost forgot about this. So what do we have here? The folder is labeled 1991. It's a newspaper art article about the fire. Tragedy at Sunnyside. It is still a mystery who untied the ropes that held up the chandelier. Unfortunately, many witnesses backstage did not survive the fire. It's a newspaper interview with a student on opening night. I was to watch the back of the theater when the fire happened. Everyone saw Chrissy running on stage. We thought it was the show starting, but she wasn't even in costume. She started yelling for help, and just then, the chandelier above her crashed down and burst into fr frames. flames. Sorry, It was awful. 1995. Oh, shit. It's a note from Superintendent Moore. Staff Administration. As you know, Sunnyside High is still struggling with admission rates after the fire. Unfortunately, we do not have enough funds to keep everyone on staff for next year. The note goes on to list several teachers who were fired from their jobs. But not the drama teacher. Folder label 2007. It's a printed email between the principal and superintendent. Principal Lee, I just looked over the report from the construction company. If this gets out, parents will withdraw their students, leading to a loss of funding. 
This tragedy has done enough damage to our reputation. Tell the workers to destroy everything and get rid of these photos. Oh, shit. Oh, they knew. They kept it secret. More than a decade after the tragic fire set aside, construction of the damaged areas of the school begins. Oh, they knew! The school knew! It's a report from the construction company. Upon demolishing the arts hallway, our workers found some videotapes hidden under the drama classroom floorboards. There was also strange furniture in the underground sewers. Please see the provided photos to let us know how to... No. They fucking knew! The newspaper clipping reads, Sunnyside High celebrates the completion of new facilities. Welcomes its largest class of students since 1990. Oh, get all the way up! You shouldn't be in here, Vivian. Why does she look exactly like Vivian herself? Oh, shit. <laughs> well then, I mean, I should have guessed that. Because that's always how it goes in these stories. That's fucking disgusting. Incredible. You did so well, guys. Holy shit. I'm floored. This was, uh... This is definitely my favorite of this month so far. God damn. Fear the spotlight, everyone. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did, because... Oh my god, did I ever. Well, see you in the next game. Bye.